welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing this really gorgeous, luminous, glowy makeup look. And I'm gonna teach you guys how to get that full glow. You wanna glow and look like you are really glowing from within. And yeah, without further ado, let's move on to the tutorial. So to get glowing skin, the first thing we need to pay a lot of attention to is definitely what goes on underneath our makeup. Our base has to be well taken care of. It has to be very hydrated. For this, I like to use the Clinique Clarifying Lotion twice a day exfoliator. And I'm in the variant 1.0 because uh, I have dry skin. So I like this because it's super gentle. It buffs away dead skin and it gives my skin a much smoother canvas to work on. So just pouring a little bit on this. In a gentle upward motion. Ooh, wait for it to dry a little bit. I love it because it's actually really refreshing and cooling. Even though it's an exfoliating kind of toner, it's not very harsh on my skin, which I like. Now that um, it's been absorbed into our skin, I'm gonna move in with the next step and I'm using my favorite moisturizer from Clinique and this is the Clinique Moisture Search. As you can see, I'm almost out of it. Uh, I super love this moisturizer because it is very, very gentle. It's very calming and it is like a gel texture that is very just really light on the skin and it's very hydrating. It works well with makeup. I really love it and I like to carry it with me on a flight and I like to apply it over my makeup even before I bought the plane because it just serves as a really hydrating layer and barrier. If you have dry skin like I do, I like to go in with the mist. This is the Clinique Moisture Search Face Spray. It's also under the Moisture Search range which is super hydrating. Mm. So my skincare is now done. As you can see, my skin is very, very plump, glowing and hydrated. But at the same time, it's not sticky at all, which is amazing, right? And then comes the star product, which is this foundation that I have been loving ever since I got my hands on it. This is the Clinique Even Better Glow Light Reflecting Makeup with SPF 15 PA++. And I love this because, you know, Clinique is super famous for their skincare. But I like it that this brand actually dedicates themselves into, you know, just incorporating skincare benefits into their makeup products as well. And this Even Better Glow uh, Light Reflecting Makeup Foundation is one fine example. This is a skincare and makeup two-in-one kind of product. It contains ingredients like vitamin C that helps your skin become more radiant and brighter and it actually corrects dark spots with continued use. With this, you want to shake it up first and then just apply a little bit on your hand. I'm not going to apply too much because the glowy skin look is also about letting your natural skin peek through. As you guys can see, the texture is so light, it's almost like a serum form. And it works well with just your fingers. So you don't have to use all the unnecessary like tools because there isn't much streaking, there isn't much caking as well with this foundation. So what I like to do is I just like to use my fingers and just pat them in. So the texture of this foundation, like I said, is like a serum. It's super light, but at the same time, it provides medium uh, coverage. And I feel that it's very, very beautiful. And what I love ultimately is that it gives me that luminous glow. If you guys can see, I'm just, just glowing. <laughs> and yeah, it's not sticky and it's not oily as well. So that is a really a plus plus point for me when it comes to this foundation. Of course, if you think this is too glowy for you, you can always go in with setting powder or loose powder to take away the extra shine. But because today we are going for that luminous glow kind of look, I think this foundation is really perfect for that. I'm gonna move in with concealer. I'm using the 3 Concept Eyes Concealer. You can go ahead with the Even Better Glow Foundation as your concealer as well because it has medium coverage. But for me, I think I need more coverage. 
I can't go a day without contouring, so I'm going to go in with the Clinique Chubby Stick Sculpting Contour Stick. And I'm also going to be using the Chubby Stick Sculpting Highlight Stick for that extra glow, especially on the high points of my face. I love it because it's so easy to use. You just have to twist up and start applying it on the parts that you want to contour. You can use your fingers or you can just go in with a sponge. Just gonna use a sponge because I don't want to dirty my fingers. This is actually super blendable as you can see. And very very pigmented. For the highlight stick, just going to put it on my cheekbones nose bridge, my chin. Now we are really glowing. <laughs> I like it that it's not that super glittery in your face kind of glow. It's more of that from within kind of radiance that we are after. And I'm using the transparent blended face powder from Clinique as well. So I'm just going to pour a little bit here. Super cute brush. And just very lightly dust along the areas where you find might be a bit too shiny. Areas that usually get oily quickly, which is around the sides of your nose and your T-zone. Just don't go too crazy with the powder because you want to retain that luminosity of your skin. If you think a little bit of highlight is lost, you can still go in and pump in a little bit more highlighter. Don't worry to go crazy with the chubby sticks because they are very natural. So they blend very well into your skin. Now we'll move on to the eyes. I'm going for a very, very natural kind of shadow shade using the Clinique Chubby Stick Shadow Tint for Eyes in the shade 04 Ample Amber. Looks like this. As well as the same Chubby Stick Shadow Tint for Eyes in the shade 2, Lotso Latte. Just this really gorgeous champagne shade. I'm going to be applying it all over my lids. I really love how easy to use these are. Just look at how gorgeous this shade is. I'm gonna take hot soul latte and just put it in the outer corners. You don't have to be like super precise with this. I have with me the Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyelining Pen over here, as well as the Cream Shaper for Eyes, and this is in the shade 104 Brown Sugar. And I'm just going for a really natural. Uh, eyeline because because we don't want the eyes to steal the attention away from our face, which is our skin. Then we will go in with the cream shaper for eyes. Very subtly create more smokiness by applying it slightly above our liquid eyeliner over here. Line a little bit at the bottom. Then we will curl our lashes and apply mascara. For mascara, I have been loving the Clinique Lash Power Mascara. I love this because it is, for some reason, the wand is really small but very, very long. And it's in a shape where it gets all of my lashes very, very well. So it coats them very evenly. Don't forget your lower lashes. Time for our cheeks. I love the Clinique Cheap Pop Blush Pop in the shade 02 Peach Pop. It's super pretty. You can see it's a really gorgeous flower. Can't really bear to use it, but smell and locate the apples of your cheek. Last but not least, we are doing the lips. For lips, I want something really sweet and kissable, but at the same time, pretty glossy and luminous also because we want to go ahead with the theme of luminosity. So I'm going to be using the Finic Pop Lip Color Primer Rouge Intense in 06 
Poppy Pop. <laughs> I love the name. It's like so cute. I'm just going to be dabbing and using my finger and shearing it out. Just look at this happy colour. <laughs> and we are going in with this. This is the Clinique Chubby Stick Baby Tint Moisturising Lip Colour Balm in the shade 01 Poppin Poppy. Oh my goodness! All the names are all super cute. So this is actually like a lip balm. It helps to hydrate your lips and at the same time give this look a little bit more gloss. Right! And there you have it! A really glowy, luminous look that is pretty natural and very easy to do. And this is the best trick to fake that glow. I hope you guys like this look and like this video. Please don't forget to check the description box below for the list of items and products I've used to create this look. And I also have a very special kit that I've curated um, together with Clinique for you guys and it's gonna come with this even better glow light reflecting makeup foundation together with a Clinique cheek pop. If you purchase these two together, I'm gonna throw in my favourite moisturiser for you guys and that is the Clinique Moisture Search and I really really hope you guys will you know, give this a try because all these three products are really one of my favourites and my holy grails for really long, especially this and now with these two in addition to my entire makeup collection. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share and I'll see you next time. Bye!